Hello, viewer. You're welcome to Suba Susugi Sat TV YouTube channel. Uh, we are glad to have you. Please subscribe to the channel. We have beautiful, beautiful tutorials on Igbo language, Asusu Igbo. Have lots and lots of videos that can help you learn Asusu Igbo, or you can that can help you teach someone else Asusu Igbo. So this afternoon, I'm making this uh, video to enlighten you more on the Igbo alphabet. There's a tutorial already on the channel that dealt with the Igbo alphabet. Mporo, Ede, Mede. Alphabets in Igbo, we call it Mporo, Ede, Mede. So there's a tutorial, and I would like you to please watch that tutorial first, and then watch this um, let later after watching the first one so that you can understand what we're going to do this afternoon because I am not going to give you everything in details again like we did in the old uh, in the previous tutorial this is basically to help you with the pronunciation of the Igbo alphabets okay so uh, let's not waste much time let's dive in straight into the business of the day okay so let's start with um, our Igbo alphabets. Let's recite the alphabets once more, then uh, we we'll take off from there. So you can see uh, my board. I hope I placed my board very well so that you can see what I have on the board very well. Okay, I guess, all right, that, that's okay, it's okay. Okay, so what I have on the board, I uh, have the Igbo alphabets on the board. I have the big letters and I have the small letters of the Igbo alphabets. Like we said, in the other tutorial, alphabets in Igbo, we say Mporo Edemede. We call alphabets Mporo Edemede. Mm. That's what we have here. Mporo Edemede. Good. That is how you say alphabets in Igbo. So this is Igbo alphabets or Mporo Edemede Igbo. Just like you have English alphabets. This is Igbo alphabet. Mporo edemede Igbo. So if I'm to say the English alphabet in Igbo, I will say Mporo edemede beke. Mporo edemede beke. Beke is English. Okay, so that's good. You're doing great. All right, so let's dive in straight into reciting the alphabet once more. Like I said, please go to the channel, look for the um, previous tutorial on Igbo alphabets. It will help you understand what we are going to do today better. Okay, so without wasting much time, we we'll start from the first one. This is A, 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 B, B, C, C. D, D, E, F, F, G, G, W, W, Y, Y, Gui, Gui, He, He, E. E, E. Notice that this has a dot above and under. So this is E, while the first one is E, E, G, K, P, Q, L, M. Ne, 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 o, o, p, r, s. Sh, t, 
on I want you to look at my face pay particular attention to my mouth as I pronounce the alphabet okay let's um, let's begin okay so please just take um, pay close attention to the mouth see the movement of the mouth as each alphabet sound comes out okay so I'll start with the first one ah ah if you move your mouth the way I'm moving mine, you will be making an attempt to pronounce it very well. Okay, that would be a good attempt to pronounce the alphabet well. So, the mouth movement for the alphabet, let's begin again. A, A, B, B, Ch, Ch, D. E, E, F, F, G, G, W, W, Y, Y, G, G, H. E, 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 J, J, K, K, B, B, Qui, Qui. L, L, M, M, N, N, Ng, 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 O, O. Ah, ah, p, p, r, r, s, s, sh, sh, t, t, u. O, O, V, V, 
we we ye ye z z okay so next we are going to uh, show you some english uh, words that have the Igbo alphabet sounds these words will help you to remember the alphabet sounds although uh, it is worthy to note that not all Igbo alphabets have sounds in the English alphabet or in English words or in the English language okay there are some Igbo alphabets that are unique to Igbo language you don't you don't uh, they, they, they don't have any English word with the, the their sounds okay so uh, those ones we skipped them but here uh, I have written down the ones that have uh, sounds in the English alphabet or in the English words so that you can you know easily remember them by going to uh, going by pronouncing those words when once you pronounce those words you recall the Igbo alphabet sound within them okay so the ones that you don't uh, see or hear in the English alphabet or in English words, they are left open. Okay, so let's look at them. Okay, so on the board, uh, let's start with uh, A. A is pronounced like the A in ant. A, A, okay. So B, B. B is pronounced like the B in ball. B. Ball. B. Ball. Okay? So, ch. Ch. Is the CH in church. But in Igbo, we don't have C in Igbo language. What we have is ch. So, if I'm to spell church in Igbo, the first two English alphabets, C and H, will form my Igbo alphabet, ch. So that is why I've underlined chi, just like in church. So this is chi in Igbo, you have it in church. Okay, so the dog, the e, egg, fin, fish, g, give, g, give, we, we doesn't have any English word uh, with the sound, but because we are learning Igbo language, the correct pronunciation of Igbo is this, Igbo. So the way is in Igbo. Bwe, that is why I have underlined it there. So don't say Igbo, I'm Igbo, that's wrong. I am Igbo, that's how to say it. So, okay, so Bwe is in Igbo. Okay, let's move on. We have no sound like that in the English alphabet or in any English word. So we go to we, we, we. Uh, we can manage when, when. It sounds uh, a little bit like when. So you can go with the GW in when as we. Then we have he, he. Hat, e, e, that is e a in eat sounds like e the Igbo alphabet. So I've underlined e a. That is e. That is the sound for this alphabet. E, eat. Then the one that has um, a dot above and under, e, is like the i you have in ink, ink, e. E, ink, okay? J, job, k, k. Remember I said there's no C in Igbo alphabet. So the C you have in K actually sounds like the Igbo alphabet. K, k, k. You have B, none. You have qui, qui, qui is the Q sound you Q sound you have in Queen. Queen, that is Queen in Igbo. So the next one we have L. L, just like you have in Lamp. L, Lamp. Me, me, man. That M 
dead is man, me, me. Then you have n, nose. So the end with dot above it is ni, ni, none in English. Then you have we, we, still none in English. Nye, nye, none in English. O, O, the O you have in orange is the sound of O, the Igbo alphabet. You have O, O, sounds like the OR you have in organ, organ, O. That is the O with dots underneath. O, organ, P, Pete, the P in Pete, P, Pete, R, R, rat, the R in rat, S, say, say, S, okay, Sh, Sh is the SH sound you have in shoe. Shoe, sh, sh, shoe. T, tank, tank, t. U, u is the double O you have in hoot, hoot. U, that is the U sound in Igbo. Then the O or U with a dot underneath is O, O. None in English. V. Van. W. Wing. Ye. Yes or yam. The Y sound there is ye in Igbo, alf in Igbo alphabet. Then, then we have the last one. Z. Zip. Z. Zip. Okay, I hope you have learned something from this beautiful tutorial. Remember, we have an old tutorial or a previous tutorial already in the channel. So please uh, refer back to the other tutorial on Igbo alphabets to help you understand what we just did now better. Please feel free to leave your comments or questions. We will promise to reply you as soon as we see them or read them. Have a nice day. Ndewo.